Well, perhaps the first thing is need to affirm why that's important to think theologically. A person, one of my members called me one day and said, Pastor, I have a question, and don't worry, it's not a theological question. Then I said to them, well, that means it's not a question. All of life is theological because all truth is God's truth. And um, therefore, to know truth, you have to know God. And when you know God, then you have a pursuit of the truth that he has revealed. Uh, so all of life needs to be framed theologically because it's for the glory of God and to enjoy God in a right relationship with him. And uh, so one of the great challenges of a pastor is uh, being driven by the gospel. How can you expose people to the joy of loving God with all of your heart, mind, and soul? And which means to also think theologically. All truth is God's truth. Now, what's the role of the Bible in this? All truth is God's truth. And all, uh, all, truth, all the Bible is true. But not all truth is in the Bible. But the truth that's in the Bible provides the foundation and the framework to evaluate claims of truth from God's general revelation. Truth is from God. God revealed himself generally in creation, and God has revealed himself in a special way in his word. Now, the word of God gives us the truth that allows us to be equipped to evaluate claims of truth from general revelation. Uh, the Bible says that, um, all, uh, that the scripture is inspired by God and profitable for doctrine, reproof, correction, and training in righteousness, that the man of God may be adequate, equipped for every good work. So my life, as it is there to, um, to be a display of God's glory, the foundation and framework is given to me in the Bible with the centrality of its message of the preeminence of Christ as creator, redeemer, and sustainer. So I want to give people from the word of God the ability to see life with theological accuracy as we increasingly grow in the grace and knowledge of Christ.